Week 3, and the battle of the acronyms is getting warm. Let's get straight into the plants. Here are our LEDs compared with last week. Vertical growth is reasonable. The rear left plant is still outperforming the others. It shows healthy growth, if it is a little leggy. We're still concerned about the leaves on the other three plants. The discoloration between the veins has become full necrosis in several cases, and newer leaves are showing signs of curling. Obviously, this is not good. We like happy plants. The only plus is that they are showing signs of new growth at the top. This is week 3 LED and week 3 HID. The difference is unmistakable. This is week 2 and week 3 of the HID plants. We're very pleased with how these chilies are performing. Leaf coloration is excellent across the board and you can see on this specimen that we have short internodal lengths. It's not leggy. This means that the plant is efficient when moving nutrients around internally to the areas that need to grow. Overall, we're very happy with all of these four. They're what we want, happy plants. Our only reservation is that one plant is showing very minor signs of leaf curl. When compared with the LED plants, this is very minor indeed. Remember, both sets of plants are being fed with the same solution. To address the problems with the LED4 and the minor issues with the HID4, we're going to drain both baths. Mix a fresh 20 litre chili focus solution to which we're adding 5 millilitres of Super Thrive. And to ensure the pH is right where we want it, just under 7, we're adding 1 millilitre of pH down. You can see in this pH test that we're just south of 7. Both sets of plants are receiving this treatment. We hope this gives us 8 happy plants. Our final battleground is power use. Our LEDs have used 35.6 kilowatt hours and our HID has used 47.49. Remember, these are total figures over the complete three weeks. That was week three of our battle of the acronyms. We're very happy with the HID4 and hoping that our fresh measures will improve the health of the LED4. Subscribe to our channel and check back next week to see how this battle plays out.